Iniciamos con las preguntas. Si alguien tiene una pregunta, levante la mano, por favor. Hola, Epi, bienvenida a México. No es la primera vez que te presentas y esta noche en el escenario de los premios Tel Okay. Bienvenido a México. Eh, ¿No es la primera vez que te presentas en México? No. Esta noche estarás presentando en los premios de aquí. Cuéntanos qué estarás cantando. Oh, am I allowed to say? Yeah, uh, I'm going to sing three of my songs. I'm going to sing uh, Girls Go Wild, I'm going to sing uh, Dreamer, and uh, Lost on You. ¿Ya estás preparando temas para un nuevo disco? Yes, uh, I've been for the, uh, many months and I will, especially this is the last performance I have of the year uh, and I probably, uh, probably for like a month after the new year so uh, I have some time and I'm very excited to just really uh, get in the studio as much as I can I've, and I've been in there already constantly so, so I'm, I'm enjoying my new stuff well, first of all, welcome to Mexico. Thank you. Uh, well, what do you have to the other year? Do you have a new project or what project do you have? Uh, yeah, I'm working on a new record to release in 2020. Uh, I'll be releasing um, some singles probably earlier in the year. Um, I, it's just more the same, you know, touring a lot, uh, maybe breaking into some new countries that I haven't been to, and um, just basically more music, you know, that's always the plan. Are you planning some... Uh, uh, ¿Qué pregunta que, que planes hay para el 2020? Ella le responde que el nuevo material, simplemente un nuevo single, absolutamente un nuevo álbum, eh, seguir con su tour, visitando los países, principalmente música, va a seguir más música en su vida. ¿Alguna otra pregunta? ¿Qué le representa estar en el Sí, Alma Rosa Camacho, del Sol de México. Eh, sí, le puedes preguntar qué le representa estar en México, qué sabe de su cul cultura, de su comida, por favor. Uh, I mean, the food is one of my favorite foods in the world. It's, uh, you know, there's, um, I think you could get as simple as possible and as complicated as possible as far as uh, spice-wise and all that. And uh, it's a staple of my diet, even when I'm not in Mexico. So I enjoy coming here, and uh, and you know, culturally, I think uh, Mexico is one of the most interesting places as well. And so I always like enjoy coming here. I feel it's very easy to um, for me to just like feel at home and, and just at ease and, and feel like I'm like experiencing something special. Okay. 